Hi, my name is Bobby from Boulevard Kitchen Oyster Bar in Vancouver, BC. And uh, today I'm going to give you some tips on oyster shucking. You want to make sure, firstly, that they're closed tightly and they want to have a really nice weight to them. They want to be uh, heavy, which is going to ensure that there's lots of nectar inside the oyster. So first of all, we want to uh, have a nice dry towel to hold the oyster so we don't want it to move around too much. And we're going to come from the back here, which is the hinge of the oyster. And we want to wiggle our shucker in until he's firmly uh, stuck in the sweet spot of the oyster. And then lean back and it's going to open the oyster and you can see that it's been uh, open. All right. We want to make sure that there's no shell debris inside. What not to do? Um, so you don't want to go too deep into the oyster because then when you pop the lid, you're going to have uh, ruptured the meat here and cut it open. So you want to be gentle during that process. If you, uh, if you go in, you don't want to go any further than just in the oyster and gently open him so we're not to, uh, not to puncture any of the meat. I really like the oysters uh, just freshly shucked with a bit of uh, lemon, uh, freshly grated horseradish and some Tabasco. Straightforward.